New Delhi, Global Terror Financing Watchdog FAT on Friday decided to retain Pakistan in its ADRI list and warn the country of stern action if it fails to prosecute and penalize those involved in terror funding emanating from its jurisdiction. A decision was taken at the Financial Action Task Force, FAT, plenary, which concluded in Paris on Friday after six days of deliberations. The FAT decided to continue Pakistan in the ADRI list. The FAT has also warned Pakistan that if it does not complete a full action plan by June, it could lead to consequences on its businesses, a source said. According to a statement issued by the FAT, all deadlines given to Pakistan to check terror funding have come to an end but the country has failed to complete its action plan in line with agreed timeline. To date, Pakistan has largely addressed 14 of 27 action items given to it in controlling funding to terror groups like the Lashkari Taiba, Let, the Jaishi Mohammed, Jam, and the Hizbul Mujahideen, which are responsible for a series of attacks in India. The FAT strongly urges Pakistan to swiftly complete its full action plan by June 2020. Otherwise, should significant and sustainable progress especially in prosecuting and penalizing terror funding not be made by the next plenary, the FAT will take action, which could include the FAT calling on its members and urging all jurisdiction to advise their financial institutions to give special attention to business relations and transactions with Pakistan, the statement said. With Pakistan's continuation in the AGRI list, it will be difficult for the country to get financial aid from the IMF, the World Bank, the AD and the European Union, thus further enhancing problems for the nation which is in a precarious financial situation. If Pakistan fails to comply with the FAT directive, there is every possibility that the global body may put the country in the blacklist along with North Korea and Iran, Sosa said. With regard to Pakistan, the FAT said, all deadlines in the action plan have expired and, again expresses concerns given Pakistan's failure to complete its action plan in line with the agreed timelines and in light of the terror funding risks emanating from the jurisdiction. The FAT said Pakistan should continue to work on implementing its action plan to address its strategic deficiencies, including by demonstrating that remedial actions and sanctions are applied in cases of anti-money laundering, AMO, and combating the financing of terrorism violations relating to terrorist funding, TIET, risk management and targeted financial sanctions, TSF's obligations. Pakistan should demonstrate that law enforcement agencies, these, are identifying and investigating the widest range of TIET activity and that TIET investigations and prosecutions target designated persons and entities, and those acting on behalf or at the direction of the designated persons or entities and demonstrate effective implementation of targeted financial sanctions against all UN designated terrorists and those acting for or on their behalf, including preventing the raising and moving of funds identifying and freezing assets and prohibiting access to funds and financial services, the FAT said. India has been maintaining that Pakistan extends regular support to terror groups like the LET, the JEM and the Hizbul Mujahideen, whose prime target is India, and has urged the FAT to take action against Islamabad. Pakistan is believed to have received strong backing from Malaysia but failed to impress Western nations due to India's consistent efforts by providing materials and evidence on Pakistan's inaction to check funding to terror groups operating from its soil, Sosa said. Pakistan needed 12 votes out of 39 to exit the agri list and move to the wheat list. To avoid the blacklist, it needs the support of three countries. The FAT meeting, from February 16 to 21, was held a week after an anti-terrorism court in Pakistan sentenced Hafiz Saeed, the mastermind of the 2008 Mumbai attack and founder of the LET, to 11 years in two terror financing cases. The Pakistani court's judgment came ostensibly to please the FAT and Western countries so that the country can exit the agri list, Sosa said. Saeed, a union-designated terrorist on whom the US has placed a US 10 million bounty, was arrested on July 17, 2019, in the terror financing cases. In last month's FAT meeting in Beijing, Pakistan got support of Malaysia and Turkey besides FAT current chair China. In the Beijing meeting, Pakistan provided a list of its action taken to comply with FAT directions. Pakistan was placed on the agri list by the FAT in June 2018 and was given a plan of action to complete by October 2019 or face the risk of being placed on the blacklist. 
BIFAT is an intergovernmental body established in 1989 to combat money laundering, terrorist financing and other related threats to the integrity of the international financial system. India is a member of the FAT Consultations and its Asia-Pacific Group.